Hey guys, what is up? It is X called X, and this is going to be the start of a Minecraft hardcore survival series. And uh, if you don't know what hardcore mode in Minecraft is, it's pretty much you get one life, and then once you're done with that life, if you get killed, then your world gets deleted off your like. You, you're not allowed to play in your in that world again. Your, the world gets deleted out of your Minecraft status file, and you're pretty much done with that world. So it's pretty much like a one life thing and then you're done. So other than that it's pretty much just a normal Minecraft survival series. Nothing really too special about it except for the fact that you die once you lose. But yeah that I kinda I like playing hardcore mode more than just regular mode because it, it gives you more of like a goal and it makes you like makes you always be looking around the corner making sure there's nothing there peeking, or, peeking around your shoulder you just be more careful and it's more suspenseful, so I, I think it's kind of more fun that way. But, uh, yeah. Also, I wanted to uh, give a shout out to the new network I'm in. It's called the Beta Network. Um, I'll probably have a link to their channel in the description. They're, they're pretty new network. They're starting to grow. They've got quite a bit of directors. Quite a bit of good directors. But, um,. Yeah, so go check them out. Subscribe to them if you're watching it on a on my channel. But if you're just watching it on their channel, then you're probably already subscribed to them. <laughs> and if you're watching it on their channel, you can come and uh, subscribe to me. <laughs> but uh, yeah. So right now, I'm probably just gonna grab some wood for some supplies, and then start building a house. Just I really hate snow biomes because there's really there's usually not enough water and too many trees so it's a lot darker everywhere and there's a lot more loading so it makes me lag even more and also there's a usually a lot less animals usually all you see in snow biomes is like almost no animals unless unless it's just my experience you guys might see a ton of animals when you're playing oh whoops, when you're playing on a uh, when you're playing in a snow biome Probably just gonna chop down one more tree and then I'm gonna start building stuff. Whoa, it's got a lag spike right there. And uh, if you're watching this on the uh, Beta Network channel, then you probably don't know what kind of stuff I post on my channel unless you're subscribed subscribe to my channel too. But like, on my channel, I usually post stuff like. Uh, it's usually Minecraft. Sometimes I'll have some other games. Like pretty soon, I think I'm, I'm thinking about doing a uh, Mario Let's Play. If you don't know what that is, it's the uh, and it's not just regular Mario either. It's Mario, but Mario is given a portal gun, so you're allowed to go through and play Mario, but in the regular Mario levels, but you're allowed to use the portal gun so you can make it through the levels quicker or just have some fun making it through them in different ways seeing how how you can get through them but also in that game you can go to um, you can play through some portal themed levels with the portal gun and, and Mario so that that looks like a lot of fun and it's really easy to, it's like not a very um, demanding game in ways of like computer specs and stuff it's a pretty small game. You don't really need any high high end computers for it. So that's pretty good cuz right now I'm just playing on a laptop because I pretty much can't afford anything else at the moment. But my birthday is coming up in less than a month. So I will be getting some money and I will be getting some new computer stuff. So right now I'm thinking about getting a loose snowball microphone and a Hapog HGPVR so I can post a lot of uh, Call of Duty videos on my channel. And also so I can upload to my new clans channel. It's if you you can go check them out. They are Seas Nation HD. They are a sniping clan. I pretty much just joined the clan like yesterday. Not I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. I'm probably gonna do I might I might do like I might be a player, editor, and 
GFX. Not exactly sure yet because I haven't really talked it all through with the leader. But if you're um if you subscribe to my channel, you can look forward to some of some Seize Clan videos going up on there. But right now I'm probably just gonna get a quick house set up because I can't really tell if it's getting dark or not because I have my render distance on short just so I don't lag uncontrollably. Oh, no, another reason I hate uh, snow biomes is because I just hate the color of this wood. Not the I like the color of the regular wood, but the wooden planks I just think they're too dark. And at night it makes it too hard for you to, it makes it just that much harder to see your house in the dark. Oh. My house keeps bugging out. Uh, I'm probably just gonna do a flat roof right here. What I usually do is... I usually get, I usually stock up on a bunch of wood, make some supplies, then I'll dig out like a basement just about the size of my actual house, and then I'll go down into the basement, and I'll dig like a wall-to-wall, -wall, like, staircase, going all the way down to bedrock, just so, because that usually gives me a ton of cobblestone so I can expand my house or make tools, and usually on the way down I get a bunch of usually don't get that much diamond but I usually get a bunch of um, iron and coal so that helps out and then I'll usually go to about three layers above bedrock three or four layers above bedrock and then I will start a strip mine and if you don't know what that is it's pretty much you dig a two by one tunnel well you, no you dig a three by three tunnel into one of the walls and then you just like once you get far enough you dig oh god I think it's gonna die. you dig just a little bit you'll dig a two by one tunnel on either side usually about uh, well, if they're on the same side, then they're usually about kind of like two blocks apart, separate from each other. So you can find ores on either side of the wall. And you usually just do that all the way down either side of the 3x3 three three tunnel. And you can usually find, that's probably like the best way to find diamonds. And like I remember one time I was on a single player world. And I, I ended up getting 52 legit diamonds in about two days from doing that. Just some quick tips for uh, Minecraft players there. Ooh, coal. I'll have to grab that before it gets nighttime. How did I miss that? Well, I guess I haven't really been over there re during this, ever since I started up this world. Let's just put this down. Need some sticks. Pickaxe. Let's go get that coal before it gets dark, which I think it is. So glad there's a cave right next to my house. Just make it so much easier for getting beginning ores. Especially coal. Which is probably one of the most important ores in the game, even though sometimes you get too much of it and you end up just filling up your chest. Kind of like gravel. Gravel is definitely the most useless piece of ore in the game, except for uh, lapis. I mean, lapis is great, but there's really no use for it. Yeah, I got enough coal to. Uh, I have enough wood. Yeah, I have enough coal and wood so I can make a door and some torches for the inside of my house there we go, 24 that should be enough for now the 
just kind of cramped. But it'll do for the for uh right now. Uh, I think I'm gonna start. Just, should I do a staircase or should I do? Let's just do this. Let's make some sticks. Let's make. Ah, I can't click. Some ladders. Well, you get th you get three ladders, three ladders now for every time you make a ladder. I thought it was only two. Well, I'm not complaining about that. One more down. Yeah, let's just make it this. Just have some extra ladders just in case. Okay, now I know what you're thinking. I'm digging dirt with a pickaxe. Don't start yelling at me. I'm just doing it because I don't have any anything else to do it with. And I probably could go make a shovel. Shovel. Make some more sticks. And a stone pickaxe. There we go. Now let's get digging.